and welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be sharing my favorites from the Simply Charlotte Mason curriculum today. So this is a compilation of things that I've used for the last three years in our homeschool. I'm going to share how I use them, why I love them, and really just appreciate the work that the Simply Charlotte Mason women put into their curriculum and how it works well for our family and just reasons why it may be something that might work for your family too. If you're new around here, my name is Hannah and I'm a homeschool mom of four children ages 10, 8, 5, and 2. And so obviously I only have two school age children and we follow the Charlotte Mason method in our homeschool. Now the curriculum that I'm sharing today is by Simply Charlotte Mason. However, whether you follow Charlotte Mason or not, these curriculum choices that I'm going to share are enrichment studies. Most of them are things that you can add to your morning basket, to your family, to your circle time, easy copyright uh, language program, things like that. So whether you do Charlotte Mason or not, I think you will really enjoy what the Simply Charlotte Mason curriculum has to offer um, us as homeschoolers. So if you find these specific curriculum videos helpful, please give this one a thumbs up and let me know down below. I'm always trying to think of what videos do you want to see here on my channel? And so if there is something ever specific or of interest to you, feel free to comment and let me know so that I can make sure that I'm creating creating content that is helpful for you and your family. But on this channel, I am looking for ways to just empower you as a mother in your home, in your home school, your health, all of the things. So hopefully Simply Charlotte Mason will um, help you in that area in some way. Simply Charlotte Mason is a established curriculum for Charlotte Mason homeschoolers specifically, but it's such a diverse and rich resource that you can, any really any homeschooler can use it. So our family primarily at this point, we have kind of evolved into um, Ambleside Online and then also simply Charlotte Mason on the side. And we have a few other things that we use as well. But if you've seen any of our homeschool curriculum videos, then you probably know that if you're new here, I will link what we are using currently for this year, our homeschool curriculum for the 2023 2024 homeschool year, I will link that video down below that might really give you a helpful overview of just my personal philosophy and the things that we use in our home. I'm saying that because the curriculum that I'm showing with you today, I don't necessarily use currently. These are things that I love. I will be circling back to over the next couple of years with my younger two children. And so I just want to make sure that you understood that this isn't necessarily things that I'm using right now. The first curriculum that I love from Simply Charlotte Mason is their copy work books. I'm a big believer that in the early years, the only thing they really need to do is just simple copy work. And so once they learn their letters and they're going through, they've gotten kind of through that like preschool curriculum type of necessities to start copy work then that's where you, you start with. And Simply Charlotte Mason, I grabbed their Hymns to Prose cursive just to show it to you. That is what I used for my second child. And that is what I will be using for my next two children. My oldest, I just didn't know about Simply Charlotte Mason. The copy books are perfect. They're simple and they're effective. And I've seen my, my children's handwriting. My girls have really nice handwriting. Their spelling is coming along naturally without doing any sort of spelling tests or anything like that. So just as an example, this is their hymns of prose. This is the copy work for cursive. And this just gives you like a little example of what the inside of this looks like. This is my second daughter and she used this book last year. She's an eight year old. Um, this is what they start. This is how they start to learn cursive. Um, it doesn't doesn't start anything else like they literally get an alphabet and then you immediately go into copying hymns and so their eye is just going to learn how to write it you don't 
waste all this time, you know, spending drawing the alphabet without any sort of application into like writing an actual word. They do the same thing for their copybooks for print. And so they have three of those. We love them. I will use them again with my next two children. They're incredible. Anyway, that's my first pick from the Simply Charlotte Mason curriculum. The next pick that I have is their Shakespeare Studies. If you are like me and you've never done Shakespeare before, but it's something, if you're doing Charlotte Mason, that you definitely need to add in, you know, Shakespeare at some point. We start with the tales, we like the abbreviated versions, but then we get into like the full on plays. So I use this last term. This is the Midsummer Night's Dream. And this was a great guide for me because I'm not familiar with Shakespeare. And so in this curriculum, it gives you like a breakdown of like what's going on in the scenes, the character, an overview. It has the full script, explanation on like, you know, vocabulary, understanding, because, you know, Shakespeare is like, you know, old, old, old poetry in English. And so it gives you some understanding of some of the words that we just don't use in our everyday language now. So I highly recommend the Shakespeare studies. Now this term, I went ahead because I had not ordered all of them when I did my curriculum haul last spring. I only did bought one because I wanted to see how it worked. We're just doing the Tempest for term two. My daughters are again, are aged uh, 10 and eight. They're in fifth and third grade. We do Ambleside year four, year two. So we're just doing the Tempest. I bought the audio version and we're reading through the play right now. And I didn't have the guide. And I do really like the extra information that I get from this just for understanding the details of like Shakespeare and the relevant structure around it. It is, you know, a resource that you don't have to have if you're on a budget, but it is, it is nice. The next thing that I absolutely love from the Simply Charlotte Mason, I grabbed two of them, but I have quite a few of them downstairs, is their um, Enjoy the Poems series. So they have quite a few of these. This is Emily Dickinson and we have Robert Louis Stevenson. And these, kind of the same idea with Shakespeare. Sure, you could probably go online and like print off a short biography you could put it together, but for a short cost, something that I can reuse, you know, again with my two sons that are the youngest, they give you your like short abbreviation of getting to know like the poet, the poet Emily Dickinson here so that they can kind of narrate about the uh, poet. They have all the poems. And again, just like Shakespeare, if there's like a vocabulary or an understanding of like Charlotte Mason poetry note, then it'll say that in the poem. So just for example, here's the sea of sunset and it describes like how to speak it. And then it says, Charlotte Mason says here, the thing is to keep your eye upon words and wait to feel their force and beauty. So you get these little true poetry notes from Charlotte Mason from like her books. Um, and then it's a collection of that poet specifically. And then it also has blank pages in the back that you can copy so that your children can create illustrations for the poems as well. So this gives you a really focused look on a specific uh, poet. And so because we follow Ambleside online, one thing that we don't follow with Ambleside is a lot of the enrichment studies because we do that in our morning time and I will link my morning time videos down below, but we do those as a family. And so we study the poet together. We study our musician together. We study our artist together, our Bible together. Like we do a lot of that together as a family where on Ambleside Online, every single child would be studying a different enrichment person. And so the Simply Charlotte Mason curriculum in general was kind of designed for big families so that families could do Charlotte Mason together. And so even though we don't do all of that uh, exclusively, I do love their enrichment studies. So these are a great investment. And of course, you can reuse them with if you have a large family, you can always circle back to these same, um, you know, poets later on. The other thing that I have a lot of is the artist portfolios. And actually my sister-in-law and I have been kind of trading and buying different ones so that we can kind of swap with each other. 
These are beautifully done. I would like to invest in all of them just to have because they're such a great resource instead of trying to like print and put together, you know, the artist and, you know, Ambleside has it. But again, this is just so well done and it makes it so easy. So each of these picture study portfolios come with a biography on your, so here's Gainsborough. We did Gainsborough last term. So it has a nice biography um, for the artist. And then each picture description, it has just a little history. So here's your blue boy, um, a little leading thought and history behind that picture specifically and where it's held, where you can see it. So this is really, this is really helpful. And then it also has like a, you know, recommended how to do a picture study. I didn't know how to do a picture study when I first started Charlotte Mason. And so these three pages are really helpful to even understand how to do a picture study. If you've never read her volumes or have any sort of understanding, that's how I came to Charlotte Mason. I had no clue. I'm still working on her novels. So these are incredible. And then it comes with like 10 different pictures. So exam for example, this is Gainsborough. So it has the different pictures. They're made out of like really nice, heavy duty cardstock. They're, you know, his most popular pictures. I, I love this one so much. So that's just Gainsborough as an example, but they have a lot of these picture portfolios. So this is hands down one of my favorite Simply Charlotte Mason um, curriculums that they have. And I get two of these and I've been trying to trade my sister-in-law, but we do a new one every single term. So here's like Monate, for example. So these are amazing, five stars in Play Charlotte Mason. And again, these are in our morning time. We actually do our picture study on Monday. And then we display the pictures of that artist through the whole term on just a little hook in our wall. You can put them in your house just so that the kids can see them and start to recognize them. Okay, so this is really, really helpful. I got this book like two or three years ago when I first ordered from Simply Charlotte Mason. I had no idea like nature study, what the heck is a nature study besides like going outside and going for a walk, right? And so I found this to be really, really helpful. It talks about basically how to do nature study um, with your kids, which is basically the foundation of science for, you know, ages under nine. And nature study is a big, big part of a Charlotte Mason education. And so this walks you through everything you need to know for doing nature study, how to do nature study. So I would recommend this just as like a teacher resource. So the next thing that I absolutely adore and everything I'm sharing today, this is not sponsored by the way, I just like love the Simply Charlotte Mason curriculum. I'm like a definitely a five star person for all the things that I've used. This study was amazing. I actually wanna buy more of their studies that they did. So this is learning about birds. I did this curriculum three years ago with my two daughters, and we will definitely do this curriculum again when my boys are just a little bit older. This is a great uh, natural history, nature study to do with little ones. Uh, it's the little, it's the Burgess bird book, which is also something that you're gonna read whether you're doing like even Ambleside, they recommend the Burgess books too. So you can be flexible and kind of add this in or inter put it in in your own way that you want. But you have the Burgess Bird Book and Blackie the Crow. And this has a lesson and readings with every single one. Now, when I came into Charlotte Mason three years ago, I had no idea anything about it. My sister-in-law told me about Simply Charlotte Mason. So this was one of the very first things I purchased that opened my mind and eyes to like the Charlotte Mason method. This was like a starting point for us among a few other things that I purchased. Anyway, and then you get these coloring books to go with. So this is from, you know, my girls like three years ago. And that is how we learned all about the birds. So I really recommend this study. I will do it again in a couple years with my boys. I learned a lot. I think, you know, that is such a great way to study um, animals and creatures. Next, my favorite Another favorite curriculum 
from the Simply Charlotte Mason is the Using Language Well, Using Spelling Wisdom series. I have a whole video on this for level one and like a step walkthrough that I did with my daughter last year. I will link that down below. That could be really helpful if you're not familiar with this curriculum. So this is their language, spelling, writing, all the things as the kids basically start around third grade, around that age, they will start using language well, spelling wisdom. And this starts out as like patient and understanding simple basic grammar rules like capital, period, all the way through eighth grade, level three. So my daughter's in the level two right now, getting into like sense and structure, but it's not the boring grammar that I remember, you probably remember, it's not like that. It's it's quotes, it's quotes and it's dictation and transcribing from books that they are either reading or poems or scripture verses. It's really, really good. I love this curriculum. I went through the first two years of my oldest daughter doing another curriculum that brought a lot of tears for her, a lot of frustration for me. It had spelling tests, it had wasted time, way too many work pages. It was a rough first two years, that kindergarten, first grade. And so when we made that switch and we switched to this, this is like, I'll call it like the tear, tear free language curriculum. <laughs> and one that is fine and it works and it does the job. So this is another five star. These are all five stars. Okay, so the last curriculum that I love and adore from the Simply Charlotte Mason is their laying down the rails. This was something that I invested in three years ago when I first made my first order from Simply Charlotte Mason. And we use this every single term. So this is a basic habit training my level this is comes with three books it's laying down the rails which is like the teacher's manual guide then it's book one and then it's book two and i have that one downstairs in our school room but each book has different habits and so the part of charlotte mason is teaching your child good habits mental habits um spiritual habits you know cleanliness habits, all of those, whether it is anything from like brushing your teeth and cleanliness to being honest, showing kindness. But it's not just like, these are the habits, you need to do it. It's like step guide to like making your child kind. No, it, it incorporates a lot of like the Charlotte Mason ideas of living books, of poetry, of literature, like Aesop's fables, those are interwoven in here, but it categorizes everything for you. So let me just give you like a quick example. Um, I'll just flip to like a habit here. Here, here's an example. So here's the mental habit. The habit is attention. Okay, so the habit is attention. It has 12 lesson lessons because most terms are 12 weeks, right? So you do one per week. So we do this once a week in our morning basket. And it gives you a lesson, like what is the lesson? So here's an example, lesson one, the habit of attention is of first importance because all the other intellectual gifts depend on it. And then it gives you an activity. And then on this one, it gives you like a poem about being attentive. Um, it'll give you a quote. Here's a quote from like Isaac Newton, I'm being attentive, um, Ralph Emerson. And then sometimes it'll have like an Aesop's fable. So. It's kind of giving them, oh here, King Alfred and the cakes, um, somebody's mother. So these stories, so it interweaves tales, poetry, and all, and it's Bible scriptures and all these lessons to help them understand the importance of that habit. So it's not just you telling them to have the habit, they're actually getting like um, some application of why is important for them to to learn it. Laying down the rails, this is definitely an investment. I don't remember how much it costs. It was somewhere like maybe $75 or something like that. But it is a curriculum that you're going to use forever, like all 12 years of your child's education. Or if you have multiple children, the all 25 years of your homeschool education. So this is laying down the rails and it makes putting it, it like compiles everything together for you so that you can just instill good lessons and values for your kids. Those are the curriculums that we love from Simply Charlotte Mason. I will be purchasing 
all of these for our different, you know, studies that we do every single year, whether it's our poets or Shakespeare, you'll see them in my curriculum halls very, very soon. But some of these are just lifelong things that we will be using or like the copy books, copy books I'll be using over and over and over again with each of my children. I love and adore all of these. And that's why I thought this was a really important video to share with you because I want you guys to know like things that I actually use and love in our homeschool. And just to show that I'm I'm a sh eclectic Charlotte Mason in the fact that I'm not a, like just Ambleside online. We love and adore Ambleside. I basically use Ambleside except for our enrichment studies and family studies because I want that morning hour as a family together. I don't want everything to be separated. I want us to have that time together. And I feel like Simply Charlotte Mason is like the perfect complement to an Ambleside online curriculum. So I hope you, you found this video helpful. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to stick around and see more of homeschool content and just mother culture and all the things um, on this channel. So that's all I have for you today. I'll see you next time. Bye.